Hello everybody, this is Veronica. Oh, sorry, I wanted to share with you guys what I've been doing lately. So here's three journals and I'm just gonna do um, a quick little flip through. <sighs> okay. Um, yeah, so I have some metal corners here. I have glittered the butterflies and I've Mod Podged everything on and then um, I took my big huge brush here and just brushed it with um, baby powder so then it's not it's not sticky I um, decorated it with some lace here and this beautiful um, flower applique and some die cuts Isn't that beautiful I just love it okay um yeah this is using a 9 by 12 envelope and it is um, single signature all right, let me go ahead and open it up. Um, make sure I'm in frame. <laughs> okay, here's an envelope. I've just glued it down in an L shape, left the top open so you, for um, journaling cards, have some just little pieces of, of stuff in here. Everything, um, just about everything has been coffee stained and um, inked up. This is just a layered punch embellishment I've made. Okay, um, here's out of um, a book I got at a second hand store. Um, here's a tiny little glossing bag. Um, this is a napkin I've mod podged on top of some paper. I don't know if you can see, look at the sparkle on that. Um, this little thing right here just flips out. This is an an no, not antique, vintage. This is a vintage um, crochet pattern. <laughs> Look at that. I love it. See that little lady? Um, the little thing here says, Your daintiest slip just can't compete with one that has edging so sweet. <laughs> So it's kind of showing you how to make um, edging for your for your daintiest slip. Anyway, I think it's kind of cute. Alright. Um, this is an ephemera piece from Jenny Heft. Um, music paper. Here's an envelope. I use it as a tuck spot. Um, the envelope has some stuff in here. Um, this was inspired by um, Megan Heft, actually. A little card in here. Um, what's in here? Hmm. Oh, it's a journaling card in here. It's a little, um, you know, just a little lunch bag. There we go. Some book pages, some line pages, and I've also, um, sprayed that so it's all pretty and sparkly. Here's a huge glossing bag that has been adhered to um, one side of a doily. Okay. And there's there's nothing in here yet. Um, this is an old, I don't know, I think a time card thing. Here's some of this. There's a little something in there. Um, here's a little bag. Sorry. There we go. And I've, um, you know, just put some tags and some journaling stuff in here. They're very simple, very plain, not too elaborate at all. Um, because these are going to be going into a local antique shop. Um, I was doing a craft fair in my hometown, and one of the ladies who owns um, a local antique shop consignment store asked if she could have some of these to sell in her shop and it's like yes of course you can so I'm yeah I made them very plain very simple hey okay, here's some more here's um the other part of that doily that I adhered the glossing bag to yeah very very simple tulip Excuse me. Again, here's another envelope flap that I've just decorated up and tucked stuff in. Here's the envelope. Okay. All the 
book pages, line pages, old book pages, cute little thing. And then I left this just open. All right, so there's the one. Um, here's the second one. Look at that, isn't that so pretty? Um, so this is a handmade flower that I've made. Um, here's just some little paper flowers and some bling and pearls, wetback pearls. It's a beautiful picture of a mountain. I'm not sure what mountain, like um, I picked up the photos from an antique consignment store. Another little flower, here's a bling piece. Okay, and then the lace just wraps around the back. Okay, um, this one is mostly craft colored. Um, again, just, you know, just little pieces of stuff here and there. <laughs> Sorry guys. <laughs> Um, they're basically the same. I made all three of them at the same time in basically the same style. Um, they have, so they all have the same stuff in it. Um, so I kind of assembly lined them. The only thing that's different is um, the pattern paper I used and like the, like I said, like the color scheme. Oh, sorry, low battery. Got to go faster. <laughs> um, but yeah, basically the same thing. They all have envelopes in them. They all have, um, yeah. Anyway, this is an, a library card from a local library. They are finally getting rid of their um, their card catalog and going digital. So I picked up a whole bunch of them. <laughs> I'm like, yes! And I'm going to be picking up more as they transfer everything over. Um, again, another napkin. Oh. See that little girl? That's so pretty. I love it. Okay. Oh, sorry. Let's go just a little bit faster. Sorry, guys. Isn't that fun? Little postcard. Um, but yeah, like I said, very plain. <laughs> Nothing really much to any of them. Oh, they're kind of boring. Sorry, guys. <laughs> There's not too much to them. And then again, this is open and all the way. Oh, it's going in. Look at the next one. Basically, the only thing, like I said, that's really different is the covers and the color schemes. Um, this one has some gold and cream in it as opposed to the craft or the, you know, the colors. Um, this has a doily on it, um, a piece of lace and an applique and the little sorry the applique came with some little flowers all around them and so I cut some of them off and just stuck them randomly inside the doily I left some of the lace to hang off the edge here um, I put some pearls around the side okay um, yeah pinks creams gold <laughs> that's what this one is Okay. Um, yeah, this is the the lace. This is the front page of the, the lace instruction booklet. Okay. But yeah, I'm like I said, I kind of assembly lined them so they're all basically the same. There's really not too much different in them. Yeah, you can see here in the back where it's attached the doily and then I have the layering for the picture on the front. Little shorty piece here. Um, another little glossy bag. I've just kind of decorated it a little bit. Some tea stained and coffee stained papers and music notes and... Shorty pieces. Um, so yeah, I'm sorry guys, it's super boring. Um, there's not really too much in here. Anyway, here it is, and they're done. <laughs> Bye.